The following video is sponsored by MobileMaddenCoins.com. If you're looking for Madden coins on any console or platform, be sure to check out MobileMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID for a 10% discount. Hey, what is going on guys? Clickwood here back again with another Madden 17 Ultimate Team video and guys today it is Team of the Week Monday which means we have some awesome cards in brand new into packs today. The biggest one, the best one of the bunch is the 91 overall Tom Brady Guys, we're going to take a quick look at this card. I am telling you, this is the best quarterback in Madden Ultimate Team so far this year. It does say it's only available for a limited time. We don't know how long that specifically is. I'm assuming 48 hours, but it doesn't say 48 hours. So who knows exactly what that even means. Uh, but basically, guys, the card is an absolute freaking monster. I just want to compare it real quickly to uh, some of my quarterbacks. You can kind of take a look at it here. The throw power is ridiculous at a 91. Throw accuracy is off uh, it's just off the charts for this card man like every single one of the throwing attributes is above a 90 that is just crazy the only one that's not is throw on the run and you know honestly like throwing on the run in this game is pretty op anyway so i'm not really too worried about that plus he's got an 83 which isn't too bad anyway so yeah Needless to say, this Tom Brady card is definitely the best quarterback in the game right now, in my personal opinion. I want to hear from you guys, though, below. Let me know in the comment section who is the best quarterback in this game. Do you guys agree with me that it's Tom Brady? Is that Steve McNair that recently came out the best one? Um, I mean, there are others as well. Cam Newton, I, I don't know. You guys got to let me know in the comment section below what you think as far as who the best quarterback currently is in the game. You guys know I have a love affair with Tom Brady, so it's, for me, it's Tom Brady. It's not even close. But uh, anyway, there are also other cards currently in packs right now that you can pull for team of the week um, very very nice ones and guys we are going to open up a team of the week bundle today uh, so we'll do that but first I want to show you guys the actual cards that are in the set today because uh, these are the ones that you're going to want to try and, and pull for because there's some really nice cards here that you can get you can either get a Darius Slay 89 overall he had a great week or you can pull an 89 overall David Johnson, which is also a freaking beast. Now, if you go in here, the four cards that you're going to need to get one of those are the elites. So you're going to need to get Marcus Mariota, Willie Young, uh, Amari Cooper, or Vic Beasley. Now, I think the best one right now is probably Amari Cooper. As far as, yeah, he looks like he's probably the most expensive. So 77.5 right now on the PlayStation 4. Take a look at Willie Young. I think he was going for pretty darn cheap, if I remember correctly. Yeah, 13000 So that's not too bad for him. Still a decent pull if you were to get him, though. Uh, and then Mariota, obviously, is going to be pretty expensive because he's a quarterback. So 60000 for Mariota. Not terrible. Uh, and then the Vic Beasley, I want to say, was going for like twenty five, But we'll take a look here. And yeah, twenty six seven five. So uh, pretty good prices on those. Now, obviously, the David Johnson eighty nine. I don't know if it's worth it when you consider the fact that you have to add in the Amari Cooper, which is a really good receiver on its own. But you guys will have to kind of decide on that. And then obviously, again, there's the Darius Slay as well. That's a really nice cornerback card in eighty nine overall. So uh, with that being said, guys, we are going to go in here. And oh, and by the way, there are also gold players as well that you can put into a set to actually get one of the elites. So that's always an option as well. And actually. Uh, some of the goal players were actually usable as well. I was looking at their attributes. They're not bad. So uh, definitely, I think this is a good time to pull packs right now if you're going to do it. So uh, with that said, we're going to go in here and take a look at these right now. We've got the uh, three team of the week pack bundle. And this is a pretty good set of uh, packs, I would say. So you get three team of the weeks, which each team of the week gives you two gold or better team of the week players. I think one is guaranteed to be from this week, and then one I think is from any other week, if I remember correctly. Uh, and then you also will get a, a topper that contains basically the same thing. So um, basically, we're going to get eight team of the week players. So that's not too bad. We'll see if we can pull anything good out of this. It is a 2100 point bundle, but uh, this is going to be, uh, I think, probably one of the first bundles that I've done this year, if not the first bundle that I've done. So we'll see what we can do here, guys. I'm going to buy the points and I'll be right back. All right, boys, we're back. 2100 points. Let's make this thing happen, dude. We got to try our best here to pull for this David Johnson for the Tom Brady is, is really the thing that I really want, man. That would be freaking amazing. So we'll start off here. With uh, the Team of the Week packs, we really need to pull some elites to make this worthwhile. We start off with the Ryan Shazier, so at least a decent gold card. And we get a Team of the Week right away, so that's good. I think this is from a previous week, though. I could be wrong. What week is this from? 
Uh, does it even say? Yeah, week three. So it's for the LaShawn McCoy one. Let's continue on here. Dwayne Washington. He's been a little bit disappointing. Jonathan Babineau. We get an elite here, and it is a collectible for Martellus Bennett. Interesting. Okay. Um, it's a, for a flashback. Okay. Come on. Joel Batoni. I have no idea what that flashback goes for. Nickel Roby Coleman. I'm pretty sure this one is from this week, if I remember correctly. Yeah, Team of the Week, Week 5. So that is a gold player for this week. Come on. Got to get some good stuff out of this. Devin Funches. At least we're getting some gold players. We get a Football Outsiders, Clinton McDonald. Okay. More elites. Come on. We need some elites, baby. That thing scared me, by the way, Martellus Bennett. Again, I have no idea what that goes for. It could be a lot. I don't think it probably is, though. He had a monster week this week, too. Three touchdowns. Are you serious, Marty B? Where were you doing? Why didn't you do that on the Cowboys? What the hell was that? Anyway, all right, next team of the week pack. Let's go, baby. Let's pull some elites. Let's go. Come on. Give me something. Oh, Mariota, what a troll. What a troll that is. Come on, and then we get a Michael Crabtree, which is pretty close to the Amari Cooper. Here we go, an elite, and it is an Eric Berry random. All right, well, I'll definitely take an 86 elite Eric Berry. Not too bad. We'll definitely be okay with that. We get a couple team of the weeks here. This one's John Kuhn. I believe this is from like week three or week four. Um, and then we get the Tevin Coleman who had a monster game. Yeah, week four for that. Uh, Tevin Coleman had a monster freaking game this week too, man. Tevin Coleman's been very, very good. This might be a decent card for salary cap, by the way. 91 speed, 90 excel. That is a pretty nice card. I wonder, yeah, he's got 85 trucking too. Like that card I think might be a low-key budget beast card for uh, for salary cap. 35 for the salary, that is not bad at all. All right, we get a Jared Veld here and not much else other than that. So uh, at least we get an Eric Berry and we get a, our two team of the week players. I wish we could get a gold out of, or an elite out of one of these instead of just the golds. But all right, man, beggars can't be choosers this year in Madden, I swear. All right, come on. Still got a chance here to pull something good. We've still got that topper as well. Akeem Hicks there. Ryan Wendell. Get a Malcolm Brown. And then another Tevin Coleman. I hope that Tevin Coleman's going for a lot because, dear God. Uh, Malcolm Brown. So we do we get two ones from week five this time? Yeah, we did. All right. So two week fives. I mean, that's at least cool. I know that these golds aren't going to be, um, uh, you know, they're probably going to go for less and less throughout the day. So I'm probably going to sell them right away to try and get the max value on them. And that's what I recommend that everybody does. So uh, we still got the topper here. I'm going to have to go back because I accidentally pressed circle. But, um, but yeah, so we're down to our final uh, team of the week bundle topper. So wish me some luck here, guys. Hopefully we can get an elite out of one of these. I really, really hope that we can. We get a LeGarrette Blunt. That's probably not worth a whole lot right now from week two. And then we get, can we get the elite? No, we get our third Tevin Coleman, man. That must be like the most common card in the packs. But anyway, guys, that is going to do it for this video. We did not get a Tom Brady, unfortunately. Let's, you know what? Let's, let's pull one pro pack. Maybe it, maybe they're just not in, in those type of packs. Maybe we need to pull a pro pack to try and get old Tommy Smiles. Come on. I'm just going to do one pro pack. Just one lucky pro pack. Let's do this. Just one time. Why not? You know, why not? And then we'll wrap up the video. Come on. Let's go from the backside. Elite. 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 Ah, Louis Delmas. Damn it. All right, guys. So that is going to do it for the video. Thanks so much. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. If you did, do me a quick favor and drop a like on it. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. And I will talk to you guys again soon.